Hello Wastelanders, Wanderer here. Welcome back to Fallout 4 Horizon. So, slept for the night. Uh, last episode, Nora kinda got her ass kicked by a dog that was legendary and decided to bite her leg off and, uh, yeah, rip, rip leg. Gonna have to fix that. Um, let's go ahead and hop in here. Gotta get Nora some food and get her healed up. Get the power armor leg fixed, etc., etc. So, got a bit of work to do. I just wish I had some was pretty. Oh, huh? just, 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 just shut up. You got water on the supply lines. Yeah. You know what? Norris got her leg bit off. You're sitting here complaining about water. What a whiner! All right, let me see here. Um. I'll just plop down some water because it might actually be affecting their happiness. Which is dumb, like I'm maxed out on how much water I can do, but um... Like none of these say they produce happiness anymore, but I I wonder if it's still hard coded in the game or something somehow. I'm not gonna do a big one because um... Like I don't think we need it. I don't think that power gen is gonna be enough. Nah, it's only five. I'll still hook it up though. I can do well no, it's not gonna be enough. I need a I need like a ten a ten power power Jenny. Uh so let's see here then. Yeah, power generators. This will do, I suppose. Or maybe um That would actually be enough, and I have enough nuclear material to maybe uh justify that. So as long as I hook it up to this as well. There we go. Now you got water. Now shut up. I need to shut your mouths. You ungrateful cretins. Uh, okay. What do I want to do here? I think we got to go back to Sanctuary, guys. I think it's time. Um. To add some supplies. Add a supply kit. Go back. Sanctuary. Yeah, we got to go back to Sanctuary and take care of some stuff. I think we need some food and stuff as well, so we'll take care of that while we're there too. And then head out on some more adventures. I think we finished up in Cambridge pretty much, so that's done, thankfully, finally. I'm playing Frost, so I am a little bit, like, out of sorts. Like, I'm kind of trying to remember. Okay, so yeah, I did the Yes Constitution stuff. I need to go and get the turbo pump bearings for those guys over here. Um, I can explore over here maybe a little bit. Not sure if I'll do it today though. And then we have a whole bunch of quests down in uh, Diamond City and around there to do. So it's time that we start moving into the real mid-game of uh, the game, which, you know, level 20 and stuff. It's about time, right? Alright, don't run. Used to running in Frost now. Because I don't care that much about pow about um, fusion cores in there because it's, it's whatever. I have plenty on there. They're not as uh, rare. Even though you use them faster, they're much less rare in Frost than they are on Horizon, so... There's Jim Bob. He's still here. Jim Bob the Crow. Watching over us. I really wonder if this is a bug or a feature now. Like, I, he, he's placed so perfectly. You know what I mean? Like, he's, he's so... It's gotta be... It's gotta be a feature, right? I don't know. Check the command mission menu here, see what we got. Gonna open up our uh, mission container here. Not a lot of stuff, but hey, we'll take it. And let's, uh, yeah, we got a bunch of guys out. I need one more militia. Could use more technicians. Let's see if we can deploy everybody. Deploy everything possible. Okay, so we have a bunch going now. Let's see. Yes, yeah, so we need to we need to make one more militia, um, and one more technician, and then we can deploy those as well. Need more supply kits. Uh, I want to check to make sure that we are producing water properly here. Let me check my production storage. There's no water in here right now. Take all that out of here. Somebody's fighting over there in the distance, but I got stuff to do, guys. I'm a bit busy, you know? 
Okay, so let's check the management here and look at our active production, I believe is what it is. Oh, well this makes sense. So I need to actually assign I need to assign more production work orders to everything. That's why. That's why we're not making any waters, because we don't have any flipping orders to do so. Okay, so service slot one, let's check that. Make sure we have everything for that. We got bottles, we got chlorine, we got cork, we got ceramic. We got everything we need, guys. We're we're good to go. So now chlorine, we don't have a lot of. Chlorine is made from salt. So and we have orders for salt from seawater and seawater. So we have both of those should be producing um, salt from seawater. Let me check. What does number eight need? Just need seawater? Right, just need seawater. Um, now we don't have any seawater, which is a problem. Um, if I go to seawater, which is nine, We have liquid fuel, so this should be producing seawater. But we don't have any right now because it's already been used up by all those previous work orders. So we should have seawater coming in, then we should have salt coming in, then we should have salt that I can make into chlorine, and then I can use that chlorine to make purified water. It is a bit uh, much. I don't know. Like, I think that's a lot to remember and think about there's a lot of processes do a to get b to get c to get d like that's a bit much in my opinion it's a bit too complicated at least that's you know it's my opinion anyway dump our stuff off okay we can move again what food do i have if i have any we got some rad scorpion steaks I'm just going to have to chug, like, a whole bunch of sanitized water. Um, by the way, Zamuno said that... Well, hopefully I'm, I'm allowed to tell you this, but uh, Zamuno said that we will most likely be using sanitized water a lot more because it does feel kind of... Um, I don't know, it feels a little bit rough um, to try and get... This removes radiation, I should be using those. It's a little bit rough to try and manage um, your water and your food. And, like, it's, it's, it's rough to try to make everything with purified water. Like, um, maybe, like, I'm just not... I'm, I'm trying to focus too much on drinking purified water when I really shouldn't be. I should be focusing more on just making some sanitized water and then using rad removal, you know? The problem is... This requires chlorine, which, you know, it's a pain to get chlorine. One other thing I can I have to remember is that um, Nuka-Cola does give you... And we have a lot of Nuka-Cola. Like, holy crap, we got a lot of Nuka-Cola. So, you know, you can drink this, too. And this does hydrate. Right? Like, so that's, that's a thing. Like... Nuka-Cola for hydration is a thing. Like, don't forget that. Uh, water's not the only thing you can drink. I, like, I think I sometimes I forget because in Frost, uh, that's not the case. Pretty sure in Frost, you can only... You don't get um, hydration. In fact, it makes you thirsty. So, yeah, that's a thing. We got more sanitized water here. So, yeah, so, like... Realistically, we actually are pretty well off as far as, you know, hydration and stuff goes. Like, we've got plenty of stuff. It's just I'm a dum-dum and, like, refuse to use it sometimes. And, like, I make it harder than it is. We did have to eat a lot of stuff there, though. Okay, but the point is now we are in good shape. Um, let me make like one minute since I'm, I'm so low right now in health. Let me make like one medicated bandage here. A few more of these. Maybe we'll do a couple of these. I think I still have trauma kits. Um, we're good on Rataway right and stuff. That should be fine. Let's get 
plenty of those chems. That's all good. So yeah, let's go ahead and pop a medicated bandage. And that will get us almost full. And then let's go ahead and check out our power armor here. Get this leg repaired. Other one. You know what? I'm just going to repair stuff, guys. Unless it's like really high like that stuff, then we'll leave it as is. Oh yeah, I got to equip that as well. So there goes that. We got a 20% and a 100% fusion core. How is our ammo doing? Oh yeah, I got to scrap a whole bunch of stuff too. So let me... um. Put my weapons... Actually, I'll put it into production storage. So it's separate. Put my good stuff into here for now. My machine gun, my laser rifle, my good rifle, and my melee weapon. Those can all go in to there for now. This stuff will all get scrapped, most likely. And um, then I'm going to put the stuff we're going to sell over here. Everything that's, like, usable for selling we'll put over there. I need, like, rifle parts, though, so even though I can sell this, I'm going to probably scrap it. Making sure there's no good mods in any of this stuff. I think the rest, we are good to scrap. Okay, let's go ahead and scrap everything. Just check that. There was no nuclear material on that thing, so I think it's only if they have good mods you have to worry about scrapping in the field. Which is the case for everything, by the way. I talked about that like an episode or two ago about how I would check to see if the Institute guns gave you uh, nuclear material um, when you scrap them. It's only if they have good mods that would require nuclear material. So, it's, like, it's not a big deal. Just make sure you don't have good mods. If they have good mods, then you obviously want to take them back and scrap them. Or just sell the mods because they're worth selling. Let's do the same for our armor here. And I think I'm just going to go through all of this stuff. I what happens if you accidentally scrap your, um, your Pip-Boy. Probably isn't good. I think, like, I'm just going to scrap everything, because I, I need some of these materials. Or I'm going to need them pretty soon. So I'm just going to scrap it all. for this round of stuff. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. Dump our sellable stuff off. I hate the spam. There is a mod that you can get that makes the spam go quicker and it goes away faster so you don't have to sit there looking at it forever. It is a bit much whole bunch of robot parts that we could use on Ada, but I don't care enough to really use them. Um, as far as ammo goes, let's see, we've got 57, so we can make like 60 so or so heavy fusion cells, pretty good. We've got a couple 7.62 rounds, which is decent. Um, we've got plenty of 50 cal. I think we're probably good on ammo. I'm not going to craft any right now. I'll keep a couple of things that I can use besides my normal stuff, but I'm just going to put most everything in here. As far as fusion cores, um, we only have one that's 100%. The rest are pretty low. But it takes us a long time to go through them, so it's not a huge deal. All right, let me get my weapons out then. That was in production storage, so let me get these. Just save here real quick after we did all that stuff. Now I want to see... Hold on, I want to see if I can make any ballistic fiber real quick. See if we have any upgrades we can do. I don't think we do. I'm not going to look into that too much. We'll look into it at level 20 when we can get a bunch of stuff. We can make ballistic fiber. So I will go ahead and do that. And we'll get one more militia going here. Over in our building over here, and uh, I'm pretty sure we have the people that can we can do it. So let's see, militia that is in production, mission jobs. Yeah, we'll do a militia strategy table over here. And that should get assigned here automatically in a second. Maybe. Yes, it's assigned. Good. And send that guy out as well. More missions is always better. 
Let me check for stuff we can dump in our compost bin. Diseased and grisly meat, those can go in. Anything here, yes, let's do a sweet roll, instamash, apples, the rest of the stuff's used in recipes, we can't, can't do it. Dump this into here. Dump our magazines into outgoing mailbox. Not that. I want that. Did I not use... Wait a minute. Did I not use that ballistic fiber? I guess I already had one. Interesting. Okay. There's that. I guess I have more than I thought. I don't know what happens if you put something in your outgoing mailbox. I guess it just disappears, which is not good. Ballistic fiber is pretty rare. We don't want to use that. Okay. And that came from our settler, I think. All right, guys. Um, I We're good. We're good to go. So where are we going? What are we doing? Trying to get through this quickly. I know I've already spent like 15 minutes in the video looking around at stuff here. I um, think we already cleared out this stuff. Let's look at our quests. So meet Travis, find Nick. Wicked shipping. Let's do wicked shipping real quick. I've been, I've had that forever and we're here. I want to get done and then go turn that in and then uh, move into Boston and start doing Boston quests. Can do the the um, the Nick quest is interesting. The uh, let's see here, there we go. This has no ammo. It's fine. This has plenty. Before I forget, let's hit up our um, the hell is it? Yeah, our field kit. And let's do some utility crafting. Convert our fusion to heavy cells and all of them, please. And good exit, exit. Right, we got about 70, 69 total uh, shots for this thing. That's good. Let's head on over to... Uh, oh, there's a bunch of stuff happening down here. People are still fighting over here for whatever reason. So yeah, let's check it out. Let's get to sniping. Pretty good shots, if I do say so myself. Not the best shots ever, but they're okay. I mean, they were headshots. One was on the move. Come on, guys. Give me a little bit of credit. All right. Let's get this loot. Head over to Wicked sh uh, Fleet Shipping. And even save me a bit of a profit on those in terms of uh, gunpowder. We're pretty close anyway. So yeah, we'll check out Wicked Shipping, get that done, and then we'll probably fast travel from Abernathy. Someone mentioned that I should have scanned before I put these oil wells down. You're probably right. Although, like, eventually I'll have one everywhere. What are you doing? Oh, you're stuck on a tree stump. Okay. Carry on. Carry on, you stupid AI. Wicked shipping is right over here. Yeah, okay. We are on course. Someone said something about a corpse next to the water tower. I don't, don't know where that is. I'm not going to spend all day looking for it either. I'm sure there's stuff I miss. It's not the other world, though. I am more thorough than most. So yeah, um, I'm sure I'm going to get questions. I've gotten a lot of questions about it. I'm going to do a, a quick announcement video talking about my upload schedule and stuff. But in case you don't want to see it or don't want to watch it or don't see it, I'll tell you here as well. Um, the plan is to do three Frost and three Horizon videos per week. So just split them right down the middle. My exact upload schedule is listed in my Discord. So if you're not in there and you want to know, go take a look. It's also just a cool place to hang out and chat about Fallout and mods and upcoming games and stuff like that. Just kind of a fun place to hang out, you know? Meet some cool people. Miss all your shots. That's okay, it was only 5.56. 
And, uh, yeah. It's getting bigger all the time, so... Come and join the fun. Huh. Did Wilson grab all this stuff? Because it's all empty. Interesting. I think I was here before already. I'm not sure, but I think I was. Oh, that that's it. Literally just smack two things and you're done. Yeah, I think I already cleared this out. Although, Wilson's picking stuff up, so maybe I didn't clear it out? There's a lot of stuff here, so... If I didn't do this, I'm going to check, because if I didn't do this, there's like a lot of stuff I want to get. Well, some of this stuff is repopulated. I don't know if Wilson already grabbed this stuff. It looks like Wilson got a whole bunch of it. But, yeah, like, if this is repopulated, or if I just forgot to get it in the beginning, then I certainly want to go okay, through here. You. Okay, that's, uh, synth, alright. Hello. Ha! <laughs> ah, get wrecked, Synth. Oh, I shot him right in the nuts. I mean, Synths don't have nuts, but, you know. We took him down with that. Okay. Well done. Well done, Ghoul. Well done, indeed. I don't know, is there more stuff in here? Is there a ghoul in here, or did that guy, that guy respond, I think? Uh, yeah, there's still some stuff in here on some of these containers. I don't know, it looks like it's been looted, but some of it respawned, basically. That's fine. We got the job done, let's get out of here. Um, so let's go back over to Abernathy. What is this quest? Oh, the turbo pump bearing, right. So let's go over there. Um, other quests we can do... Trinity Plaza, uh, Bunker, Nordhagen, uh, this thing, Minutemen. I think uh, we're going to go into Diamond City and get those quests knocked out and then maybe go and try to find Nick and get the main story started. I don't know if we'll get all that done today. Probably not. But we'll get done what we can. Now, the last day, I mean, I'm going to still be doing seven episodes per week. The last day of my schedule, um, I'll be doing basically whatever I want. That might be Frost, that might be Horizon, it might also be a totally different game. Because I need to, you know, be able to play some stuff on my own that's not not Fallout 4 occasionally. You know? I think that's think that's reasonable. Let's just go to um Let's just go to home plate and we'll go from there. Check our vendors while we're here too and see if they have anything to sell. And if they do, great. Not, no big deal. And um then we'll just go and talk to people in Diamond City and get some quests knocked out here. Huh? What you got for me? Oh, yeah. you. Oh, yeah. You got the good stuff. It's really expensive, but... Last time my vendors, like, disappeared, yes. they weren't here. So I couldn't, uh, couldn't buy stuff. Okay, let's sell all this stuff. Except for a couple things. Aerodynamic hand axe. Still, yeah, it's nowhere near as good. Frag mines, eh. Eh, I think I'll just sell them. Same for those. Uh, a bunch of this stuff we can sell. Wedding rings are worth a lot too, but I think they're actually gold's worth keeping them. I don't know. If I'm ever hard up, I guess I can sell them. Huh. This one weighs five. I guess that's from a trap. That must It must be different because it's from a trap. I don't know. I'm not sure why it is. I guess you can break it down, though. Interesting. We're going to pop ourselves some great mentats. And... 
And let's sell like all of these almost pretty much. That, that, that. And then all this stuff, we're gonna, we're gonna get all of that excess taken care of, the excess might taken care of by, uh, buying some stuff, so not a big deal, don't worry about that. Um, I don't really use these explosive charges anymore, and I can't break them down, so, like, all I need is the advanced ones, so. Really, like, all I need, or all I need is the master ones, so. I'll keep the safe auto dialers and the auto hackers. I actually don't even need this, these anymore, do I? I guess I'm done with those two now. Sells for eight, those synth parts do. It's pretty good. It's nothing to sneeze at. Eight caps, you know? Okay. So, what do I want to buy here? Um, we have energy cells coming in. We're going to need powder, though, most likely. So I'm going to go ahead and get a canister of powder. So it's expensive as hell, but, um, you know, that's worth the cost, I guess. I can't afford this. So, um, yeah, we'll just leave it at that. That's quite a bit of powder. And now we are broke. Pretty much broke. It's okay. That will all get transferred over. Hi, how are you? But yeah, I'm happy with that. Get outside. And there are people we have to talk to. Could go and see Shang as well. I doubt he has more water, but I'll check. Mainly I want to go and see uh Paul Pembroke and do the uh the drug quest. The drug dealer quest. get that quest done. There's a quest with the um, the doctor as well. I'm not sure what triggers that, though. I can't remember. Might just be later in the game, too. I'm tempting to just pick these things up, but um, yeah, there are guards. Might, might be bad. Might turn out very badly. Stealing is such like an all-or-nothing thing in these games. Like, if you steal and you get caught, you just get, like, shot on sight. And then it's like, oh, well, you have to reload. I don't know, it's kind of silly. Like, the whole stealing mechanic is kind of silly. I mean, I get it, like, for immersion purposes, but the fact that if you mess up, you just Come get on, shot. I ain't standing here. Oh, yeah, he's got water. Okay, cool. We'll buy it all. Give me that you water. Me in my I'm cool with that. We're pretty broke now, though, so we gotta go make some money. Time to go exploring. We have vendor credits, but uh, those are nice not worth what they used to be. In this version, uh, when version 1.8, they're only worth like a 10 to 1 conversion rate for bottle cap. So really, it's only like, I only have like 100. Uh, it's not past 6 p.m. yet, is it? It's not. Nowhere near. That's fine. We're going to go and talk to the guy in the upper stands, Paul. And... Uh, Intervene in this whole domestic scuffle up here. Come on, Darcy, let's go. Take it easy. I don't think she wants to leave just yet. Hey, this is between me and my wife. Why don't you mind your own damn business for once? Oh, God, Paul, why do you always have to make a scene? Pour me another drink. Damn it, Darcy, I just want you to come home. I'll be home. Later. I can't believe you'd do this to me, Cook. Do what to you, Paul? You smug bastard. What do you got, Cook? Oh, you got purified water, too. Yeah, I'll buy that. You keep away from my wife, goddammit. You'd better get out of here before you do something stupid. Uh-oh. Son of a bitch. Don't hurt him. Power man. armor's in the way. Here we go. Go on. Get out of here. I'll be at home, Darcy. Taking care of our son. 
Oh, Darcy, you bad mother, you. With a big nose. Sorry I had to see that. Things are usually a lot quieter around here. Perfect place to drink, if you're buying. Already did. What was that argument about? What was that argument about? Uh, nothing much. You see, Darcy here likes to relax and enjoy life from time to time, and her husband Paul doesn't. He's not a bad guy, really. Just a little uptight. Too bad he can't learn to relax, huh, Darcy? Shut up. I don't come here to talk about Paul. You there! I haven't seen you in here before. Why don't you make yourself useful and buy me a drink or something? You don't need another drink. You don't look like you need another drink. Aren't you all high and mighty then? Why don't you get lost so I can drink in peace? Lighten up, Darcy. This isn't your own private bar, no matter what you might think. Anyway, I got a bar to run. Ordering? Uh, no thanks. Not looking to buy right now. Some other time. Gotta turn all my booze into antiseptic. Alright, so, um, yeah, that triggers... That triggers the quest to go and talk to Paul. And, uh, Paul wants you to go and kick Henry's ass. And then... It's kind of weird, like, for some reason Henry feels bad about it, and he's like, okay, I'll cut you on this drug deal. Which doesn't make any sense, but that's how the quest works, so, you know. Yeah, we gotta go find Paul. There he is. Whatever you want, I ain't got time. <clears throat> hey, you there. I, um, I have a question for you. Okay. Go ahead. I'm listening. You were in the tap house before, when... Yeah, you got your ass kicked. You got beaten up by the bartender. Yeah. Good old Henry Cook. Everybody's best pal. Especially Darcy's. I'm supposed to pretend I don't know he's sleeping with her until he decides he's bored with her and she comes crawling back home to me. And, uh, where do I come in? So, where do I come in? I'm going to go back and talk to him and I want you to come with me. You saw? He won't take me seriously otherwise. I don't want to have to really hurt him. I just want him to leave Darcy alone. And you're going to reward me for that? You're going to have to make it worth my while. Uh, well, okay. I can only pay you 80 caps right now, but I'll scrape together more after we take care of Cook. All right. Let's go. Let's go. You do the talking, I'll be the intimidating presence. All right. Come on. Let's go, Paul. I'm going to kick his ass. I mean, I'd shit my pants if somebody in power armor came up and wanted to fight with me. It's going to be Trump. Got it? Eh. That's what I say to you, buddy. Eh. Paul, where are you going? Nowhere you need to worry about. Whatever. I'll see you at home. Just how she talks annoys me. Whatever. Ahem. Bruh. Nah. I'll meet you there then. Don't be late. Yeah, yeah, I'll be there. I just have to close up. We need to talk. Jesus, Paul. What now? It's time for you to shut up and listen, Cook. What the hell is this? And what are you doing here? Don't tell me he's hired you to help lean on me. Maybe? Ah, crap. He's out of dialogue range. Come on, dialogue. There we go. Come on, let me talk to him. That's correct. That's right. You should listen to what Paul has to say. You're making a mistake getting mixed up in this. Well, I'm listening, Paul. What do you have to say this time? Just this. You leave Darcy alone, starting now, or else. Now that is a very bad idea. You don't want to pull a gun on me unless you intend to use it. But you think I won't use it? Huh? Do I just need to kill you? Is that what you're saying? Um. Um. Uh, yeah, don't shoot. Paul, put the gun away. Nobody needs to get shot here. 
Hey, hold on. I'm sure we can work this out. Keep talking. Look, I, uh... I'll stay away from Darcy from now on. It's over. You have my word on that. Your word? What's your fucking word worth, huh? I'll make it up to you. I know a way to get a lot of money right now. You and I both know the only reason Darcy comes up here is she's pissed at you. If you were flush again, everything would be different. Besides, I owe you for what I've done. Well, what do you think? Yeah, sure, what's the plan? How are you gonna make us all rich, Cook? Gather around and I'll tell you. Here's the deal. I have some other, um, businesses on the side. One of them is helping Nelson Latimer spend his dad's money to make himself feel like a gangster. Money. I like the part about the money. Holy shit, Cook, does Malcolm know about this? What do you think? No, of course not. Anyway, that's between him and Nelson. So where was I? Oh yeah, me and Nelson are supposed to be meeting some gentleman from Good Neighbor to exchange Nelson's cash for their chems. My plan is simple. We take the money and the chems. All right, let's do it. I'm in. Let's do this. What do you say, Paul? Are we good? Good? Hardly. But I don't mind you helping me get rich. All right, so we're going to ambush them and take their stuff. And uh, you don't get anywhere near as much in Horizon as you do in the base game, because of course it's nerfed, but it's still pretty good. What I find weird is, uh, what I find weird is Henry Cook's sudden change of heart after, hey, I don't know, I ain't saying I shoot. he just seems so sincere, which is weird. Alright, let's go. We gotta go up north and take care of this quick. And then there's a quest here to go to the east to, uh, the one fish packing place? I forget where it is. It's some out-of-the-way factory somewhere. And then you can get a whole bunch more stuff in there if you know the code to get in. And, uh, yeah, Nora's not leaving any witnesses, by the way. I, like, I know some of you guys get upset when Nora does, like, mean things, but my Nora is not, like, a innocent, dewy schoolgirl Nora. That's that's not how I'm playing Nora. She's, she's hard and she's mean. Like, she's going to do what she has to survive, and that might mean siding with the Institute. I'm not decided yet, but we'll see what happens. I'm not sure if I can bring myself to, to portray the Brotherhood, uh, but, uh, yeah. In my head, can I would say that the best possible ending would be to use the Institute for the good of the Commonwealth. See those big lights? That's right. Working electricity. Nobody cares. I got, like, 20 settlements with working electricity. Nelson's starting to think he Keep doesn't scatter. So yeah, we're going to kill everybody here, including this guy. And uh, Nelson and everybody else. And uh, I don't care. And yeah, we're going to... Some people are going to get pissed and they're going to come after us. But again, I don't really care. We're late. But I'm sure Trish won't hand over the chems until I get there. You see... I'm the one she trusts. Little bit arrogant there, aren't you, Mr. Uh, Cook? Now, the, um, yeah, we're going this way because I want to ambush them from over here. Luckily, he's not nearly as smart as he thinks. Here we are. The meat is just ahead. There's always four of Morowski's goons. Trish, who's in charge, and then three other guys. No grenades. Aw. Alright. Guys to unload the boat and wave their guns around. You should be able to work your way around these buildings to get a good angle on them. I'll wait for the shooting to start. Then join in from here. Remember, we can't afford to let anybody get away. Right on, no witnesses. Alright. 
Well, uh, I think maybe this calls for some jet. What do you guys think? Make sure we get everybody taken care of really quickly here. Yep, six is jet still. Let's do it. Can't leave witnesses. Nothing personal, but I can't leave any witnesses. Wait! I can tell you how to find Morowski's cam lab! You can get his whole stash! Sorry. No witnesses. I think I'm okay. Trish. So that's that. I told you it was no problem. The money should still be on Nelson's body. And then there's these chems, which you'll need to sell somehow. But that's your problem now. I'm leaving town. Ooh, holy but shit! A thousand caps. For Paul to have me gone. God damn! Plus, there's no plausible way I could explain to Morowski how I wasn't involved in this unless I die here along with everyone else. Yeah, you won't be able to blame me for all your problems anymore. Okay. I could kill him too, but uh, nah. Why can I not open this yet? Do I have to do the talk to this guy first? Why can I not open this shit? Is this a bug? you're supposed to be able to open this 100%. Hey, Paul. This has got to be a bug. Alright, well there's, um... We got a note. That tells you how to get in. Yeah, first here's a note. Here we go. Yeah, so you have to do it in this order to actually get inside. So, uh, yeah, I'll probably have to take a screenshot of that and then do that. Does that do it? No, I still can't open it. Why the hell can I not open these? Okay, I think I have to talk to Paul, but I can't actually do it. Do I still- is the quest still active? Let's divide the spoils. The hell can I not? Okay, here we go. Did it finally go through? I still can't talk to him. I want to reload, guys, and see what happens. This is really weird. That I can't talk to this guy and finish the quest. Let's have to talk to Cook instead. the hell? I mean, this is clearly who I need to talk to. Hook is no longer an issue, but he's just not... can't talk to him. Well, um... Did that work? Apparently not. All right, I'm just gonna try to see what happens. Is this what I have to do to get the damn thing because he bugged out? Apparently it is. Oh my God. Does Nora have to be a bitch just because of this? Like it's a bug. I didn't want to kill him. Um, let me reload again. This is definitely a bug. 
Not sure how to fix it, though. I could just wait and come back. But yeah, you guys can see, you get like two of each chem in each crate. It's pretty good. I think I have the power armor. Try talking that way. Hey, Paul. I can't pick her up. Apparently she's too heavy. It's like he's trying to talk to Trish. Hey, Paul, here's Trish. There you go. You talk to her, okay? You, you done? Now can I... Can we do the quest? No? How about now? You're just bugged as shit, aren't you? Okay, I guess this is what we're doing because I can't get the chems otherwise, and I want them chems, boys. I want them chems. So I guess consequences be damned. Darcy, your husband is gone. Hope you're happy. Way to go, Fallout. Way to be a dumb, dumb game. All right, so we got to go... Um and get access to Rouse's chem lab, which is all the way over here. We'll do that when we go over to get the castle eventually, but not now. Um, what next? Travis we could do, but not right away. Um, that one's done. I do have a couple quests for Trinity Plaza. Which is a pretty cool place. Um, yeah, I think we just make our way over. Now, when I go back over there, they're not going to be super happy with me, but um, have I been to Baxter Apparel yet? Yeah, I have. It's one of the few places I've explored, I think. But yeah, we're just going to kind of make our way through Boston, exploring as we go, getting loot. Clearing it out as you normally do. And making our way towards Trinity Plaza. This is where the fun begins. I've already gone through some of this stuff. Not all of it, though. I already killed the raiders over here. I'm not sure why the trap was reset, but it does mean some free weapons, so okay. Wish it would be a little bit nicer out today. Fog's kind of crappy. Better than my trip to Glowing Sea in uh, Frost, though. That was pretty brutal. Whoa, bit of a slow down there. I'm going to get a save in. So bizarre that I couldn't complete the quest normally. Sure someone in the comments will tell me how I could have done it. Uh, but, uh, oh well, it's too late. I'm so used to having my uh, jetpack on Frost now that not having it here does indeed make me quite sad. I think I said it probably would when I was in Frost. And yeah, it definitely has. Kaboom. I can't believe Zawano left in that huge amount of caps, though. <laughs> Almost a thousand... Really? The range on these things. I swear they're like less than they used to be. And that is just weird as hell that I can't hit this guy properly. It's just so stupid. Kept clipping on the right side. It's like the arc, the arc is much different than what it would look like it would be. 
I like that the game uses the actual arc of the weapon, just, you know, like Dark Souls and stuff like that does. I, I like that. It does make aiming really difficult, though, whenever your character uses a random swing animation, like, every time, and you don't know what it's going to be, and you have to just, like, roll with it. It can be kind of a pain in the ass. Oh, yeah, here's a library. That should be fun. And there's Trinity, I believe. There's a guard area over here that we can go and loot. There's probably some rust devils. It is, for whatever reason, not stealing, which I'm okay with. Man, Nora just, just orphaned somebody to get some drugs. Gotta think about that, you know? She's just doing what she got to, sur to survive, man. Gotta find Sean, right? Was the legendary one? Best of went running over here for some reason. Little ooh, purified water, nice. Little nook over here with some stuff in it. This has got to be, yeah, it's a little side area. Usually there's some dogs over here that go and attack whenever you go over here. I guess at this point it's, yeah, there's dogs there. You can hear them. <laughs> Dead dogs now. Go check for cars in here. I'm pretty good on nuclear material and stuff so far. Hello. Random raider. It's kind of weird that there's a random raider. Come on. Come on, game. Work with me here. Kind of weird there's a random raider, like, so close by to the guards. You would have thought they would have flushed her out, you know? I'm out of combat. I'm going to go ahead and heal up a little bit here. There's a nice boss chest up here, but also, I remember there are some traps up here. One there, not sure what, oh, it's this right there. Yep, there we go. I swear there's one more trap up here somewhere. I just can't remember where it is. Maybe it's up, up further, up top. It's right there. Okay. Could I? Oh yeah, I could have. I could have gotten that tension trap. I was like, wait a minute. Could I have not gotten that anyway? But now I could have. Salt shaker, good stuff. And that is. Yep, yeah, right over there is another one. 
combat shoddy. I did try out combat shotguns. Uh, I wasn't super impressed with them. Darn it. Wasting ammo with my twitchy finger. All right, so we can go to the police rationing site down here. See, so yeah, it's going to be a lot of exploring. A lot of exploring and killing in the next couple episodes, guys. This is a raider place. That's it. Disappearing act, huh? Holy shit. It's called shooting straight, rookie. Okay, good to go. Ooh, nice. More sneaky sneaky, think I already have that. Pocketed power, or pocketed uh, combat armor, it's nice. Combat stim pack. Good shit. Really low FPS here, though. It's not that bad. It's not that great either, though. I can deal with it. Like, it's not a huge deal. It's like maybe 40 or 50 FPS. It doesn't really get bad until you get down in the 30 FPS range. That's when it really starts to be... I don't know, you can really feel it chugging. It's not good. Is it everything? There are a lot of little spots like this that are just not marked on the map or anything. Just spots with a bunch of raiders and stuff. You can get that rad stag, just run up on top of it and swing this thing. If I can actually get up here. Are we near the Leighton Towers? Is that nearby here? Don't recall. Why am I sneaking? Eh, let's go find out what, what's fighting what over here. Oh, it's Rust Devils fighting guards. You're welcome. Might have been the remains of the guys that we fought that just went running off in some random direction for whatever reason. Looks like they trashed these guys pretty hard.
Maybe I should have bought energy cells, but like I'm so close to being able to convert my energy cells or my uh, power things, my excess power things to uh, energy cells and then making fusion cells or two millimeter or something else out of them. I'm so close. Feels bad to buy them when I don't think I'll need them as much in the future. Feels bad to use them on fusion cells too whenever two millimeter is so much better. Once I've got the handmade gauze. But anyways, guys, um, we'll just continue exploring and stuff on the next one, but I think we're going to wrap it up here. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.